Okay, this is the final three star from the um, War Against 300 of Exodius. Um, here you can see the attack is going to be Golem Lava Loon, one Golem, two Wizards, just to make sure things go straight. Um, he'll get let the Golem direct the fire, um, drop some wall breakers um, when it's all clear, and they're all focused on the Golem. Open up the pocket, kill the Queen, and try and kill these two um, ADs, and maybe even go for the Inferno, we'll see. Um, and then lava the rest of the base. Um, fairly close ADs um, here, but you've got you've got a good freeze here um, if you sort of clear out these two. Um, so basically, leaves you with this sort of final AD protecting the base and some wizard towers to take care of. Anyway, let's have a look at the raid. So we've got Lorax um, hitting. Um, we've got is that two golems in there? So um, opened up the pocket. So two golems will take a fair bit of fire. The queen's hitting one of the golems. Um, the queen's about to die. King dropped fairly late, which is good. Keep the king nice and fresh to deal with the CC. You can see the CC comes out now. We've got a zap, so I'll let the CC bunch and probably zap about now. Near the witch, yep. Um, and um, you still got the king with the king ability. Using the king ability to try and bust that wall. Some wall breakers would have been handy there, but I guess it's under the inferno, so it wouldn't have worked. <coughs> so, um, Queen um, merrily knocking out the various bits and pieces around. Okay, we've got the Queen's going to take out the inferno. I don't know if the Queen's going to get the AD here, but I guess you'd rather have the inferno, wouldn't you? Uh, no, the Queen might get the AD. No, not going to make it. But anyway, um, an Inferno, the Queen, and an AD is a pretty good result from um, two Golems. So you can see um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So um, just watching the drop closely. So 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, targeting those two um, defense buildings. Got 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2. I'm targeting, uh, I don't know why I dropped those two. But anyway, I probably want some extra ones to come in at the Inferno. Uh, lava. One, two, one, and one, two. So probably, you know, not the typical um, two against each or three against each, but um, reasonably good drop there. Um, but And plenty to come through rag, um, raging through on that Inferno. So that basically leaves you've got the one AD left. Um, that lava should pop any second. Got a lot of bunts balloons, which is a bit of a worry with um, these whiz towers. But should have enough there to make it through. Might have been nice to have one balloon to just draw fire off this main bunch just at the end, um, or, two, or two balloons just to sort of manage the whiz towers would have been probably in a better raid structure. But um, obviously three starred, so got away with it. Oh, and I had some wall breakers too, so I could have had, had enough room for a balloon. But the whiz tower goes down and then the base is gone ski. So anyway, great there, raid there from Lorex. That was actually in the last sort of two or three minutes of the war. Um, brought it um, to 4-5, um, really close war, hardly fought, um, and lots and lots of fail raids for three stars as well. So it was a great battle, and look forward to finding 300 again. They're, we're, we're one win, one draw, and one loss to 300 now, so they're a bit of a epic clan for us to war.